like screwing up on me like a few times but basically what I was saying was that um, I do like to keep you know waking up early-ish on my weekends even though you know Monday through Friday I do wake up earlier because I take my 7 a.m. CrossFit class Monday through Friday but I still like to keep the same routine on the weekends like I don't change it up I'm going to wash my face with that beautiful machine right there also I'm going to drink some water and yes Stormy we are also going to feed the cats and if any of you are cat owners or cat lovers out there who are interested in what I feed my cats it's nothing specific um I do get this other type of dry food but there is this liquor store down the street and my cats are very vocal when they're hungry so I just got that for right now but I will let you guys know the brand I just can't remember the brand name right now of the dry food I get for my cats and they're two um, adult cats now. So, let's wash my face. It always falls off my chin. <laughs> wow. Making, it really makes a difference when you change your water source. Like when it comes to washing your face from tap water to my water ironizer machine, the Kangen Beauty Water. Like it's a game changer. And then just drinking a full glass of water just makes a huge difference in my morning. Like, it kind of would always make me think back of why I felt like I always needed coffee first thing in the morning. But in reality, it's like, you actually need water because you're literally sleeping for 10 straight hours with no water. So it makes sense why you feel like, oh my god, I feel like I'm dying. But it's like, no, you're dying because you're dehydrated. So, drink some water, guys. guys I had to wash them because I don't like to give my cats dirty dishes and honestly they look pretty nasty hey man just gotta show you guys something do any of you have a greedy cat like this one Nova why are you so rude I'm preparing your food huh you're so rude can you be patient, please? For mommy? No, oh, that was a no. So rude. I do a mix of dry and wet food. So I'm going to put some of this on the bottom. Oh my gosh, Nova, you're ruining my video. I may have to do this for voiceover. God. If any of you have a greedy cat, can you tell me how to shut them up when I'm trying to feed them? Jeez. You're so annoying. I like to get a variety of specific types of wet food for my cats. So I like to get like the friskies or um, there's like this fancy feast one. I was like grilled. Some is pate, but it's cool that they have that option like of grilled meat so it literally looks like cut, cut up beef or something like that. I have these two left and we have liver and chicken feast and gravy grilled. That doesn't sound delightful but it probably is delightful for the kitties. <laughs> and we have, this is pate style and it's cod, sole, and shrimp feast. I'm gonna do the liver and chicken feast so you guys can see the grilled one. I feel like a lot of people know what pate is and this is what it looks like. And then I only put a little bit of the dry food on the bottom of each bowl. Oops. And then I'm going to mix everything. Um, I'm gonna put this on top and then mix it all together so they get a combo of dry and wet food. See what it looks like. Almost looks like normal people food, but something I don't know if I would eat because it has liver and I don't know about eating liver. So, oh my gosh, look at this, Nova. 
Oh my god, you're so impatient. Help. That's what, that's the end result. Gosh, you guys are so annoying. There you go, Dormy. There you go. Little turd. <laughs> All right, so pretty much after I feed the cats, I'm going to go ahead and make my bed and I'm going to do a workout. I'm thinking of maybe taking a nice walk out um, in my complex area. It's not like crazy, but I just want I just want to go outside for a little bit, and then I'll probably do a YouTube workout video and take you guys along with me. As I started my walk, I was like, well, why don't I just get a cup of coffee? Because <laughs> I'm going to do a YouTube workout anyway, and I might as well just get myself a decaf coffee to mix with a mud water. I'll show you guys how I'll make that right now when I get back home. Um, but yeah, I just decided to do that right now. So we're going to go ahead and get a quick cup of coffee. Let's go. Okay. I'm waiting for my coffee and I just saw these. Oh my god. I'm not much of this type of creamer person, but I may have to take some. Yes. My fiance loves these ones. But I'm just waiting for my coffee, but I'm definitely gonna try this. I'm going to do a yoga with Adrian yoga workout video. This is day 19 and it's called Balance. She has her 30 day yoga journey and it's called Home, you know, specific to this whole pandemic thing that's going on. So she has this awesome playlist and I'm on day 19 and I really enjoy it. I honestly enjoy all of her videos, but this playlist specifically has been really awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and do it. All right guys, so I just got out of the shower. I just put on my go-to black high-waisted jeans and then I got this um, cute flowy white top for my birthday. So I just put this on and your girl is starving. So she's gonna make some breakfast or meal number one because I feel like it's super late to have breakfast now, but I'm gonna have some breakfast and then make my mud water and show you guys how I make it.
I just made some eggs with some spinach and there's a little bit of mozzarella cheese and then just because I like ketchup I like ketchup on my eggs no judgment please okay and then I have some little pork sausages that I'm going to have for some protein and then I made um, I think this is plant-based is it I didn't add eggs in here so yeah these are plant-based blueberry pancakes and basically all I did was add one banana I added about a cup close to a cup of oat flour I basically just got rolled oats blended it blend it I can't say it I blended them really quick into the blender and then I added some flax milk that I got from sprouts and then I pretty much just mixed it all together and I added since we're doing a fall vibe I added some pumpkin spice to the pancakes and then right before I flipped the pancakes I added some fresh blueberries that I also got from sprouts and um, on top I am thinking of putting some raspberry jam made like this raspberry chia seed jam so I'm gonna see what it tastes like on top of it and yeah this is pretty much my breakfast um, I haven't really eaten at all aside from just drinking my mud water so this is almost kind of like my first meal I mean it is pretty late now um, but usually I don't take this long just filming and doing a bunch of things um, just got most of my time so yeah I'm just gonna eat this so pretty much after I eat my breakfast I have I recently got this vitamin pa um, package it's a subscription service and it's called care of and they basically give you 30 packs of a vitamin pack um, of whatever your concerns are you basically take a quiz and it asks you just like all the questions that you need to be asked for all your health concerns and things like that so I took a short quiz and they gave me my vitamin pack so I'm gonna take one for today and it's so cute because it says hi Nathy focus hi Nathy and then it gives you like little messages so sometimes it's like today's challenge or like today it's like how's it going we're here to help if you need it you know to contact care of and then in the back you it's all clear so you can actually see all the supplements I take um, in this I take a probiotic I take a vitamin for my stress and mood and for muscle recovery because I am working out a lot more often now I have a couple magnesium that I have to boost my energy and to also help me when I am about to go to sleep and then I have a vitamin D and a keratin pill because of my hair, skin and nails. My hair is kind of thinning out now. Just so. wanted to up my game with my vitamin supplements and just supplements in general. I never was really a person to do supplements. But now that I am, I am feeling the difference. So I'm really liking how I'm feeling with these supplements. So if you want to check them out, totally recommend their website. Go to Care Of. Go even to their Instagram and you can take the quiz from their link in bio. I don't have a discount code for you yet because I am pretty new and I literally just got this. But yeah, you guys should check them out. Care of vitamins. Love them so much. So I have my uh, plant-based pancake that I made. And I put some of my raspberry chia seed jam on top. So I want to see how it tastes with this. Oh my god. Mmm. Mmm. The jam on all the pancakes. So good. Mmm. 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 I go back to my planner and I recently got this planner at Target. And it's super cute. It's not crazy looking, but it's just simple. It says agenda on it. And what I love about this is that first, when you open it, start each day with a grateful heart. Like, how amazing is that? And then if you see these tabs, it's the tabs separated by month. And then every time you go to a new month, you get the whole month. And then you have like this little note area that you can put. And then for that week, there's this page and it says this week. And it has areas for your to-do list. It has this week's goals, like an etc. box if you want to put anything extra there. And then it has, you know, people to call, who to email, what to buy, and etc. And then you have even more space for your daily things like Monday through Sunday. So 
I honestly love this planner um, as you could see like before in my October it's pretty crazy oh I don't want to show you vlogtober schedule but yeah it's pretty crazy I go a little crazy with my planner if anybody else is like this let me know in the comments so I don't feel alone yeah I'm crazy with my planner but I just got it not too long ago so I really only used September and October um, but I'm super excited to go more in depth with my planner and see what else um, I can incorporate into this planner but yes I just want to show you guys this really quick um, as part of my morning routine before I even do any other things regarding work um, personal things errands I always look at my planner just because I write in my planner the night before all the time of what I know I have to do the following day and always going to my planner the next morning is super helpful if you guys haven't already go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't seen my intro to vlogtober I mentioned that I'm going to be doing a challenge and uploading two videos per week so hit that bell notification so you can get notified every time I upload 